This is the ProAim Quado, a four-legged tripod, a quad pod. I see these as my ultimate non-ground spreader legs. They essentially have no spreader because of their rosette style leg angle locking system. I really like the ability to choose the angle you want the legs to lock. Great to have these ratchet knobs for adjusting the height of the legs. But then when you need to loosen them, you just twist without having to pull. And then I get the legs down to the height I need. Here we can see how easy it is to get all the legs to a rough, similar height and length. This is what I like to do with my other tripods where I unlock every leg and lift it to the height I need it. So now my tripod is fully extended. I can then go angle each leg to the angle I need it to and lower the leg needed to level the head. Uh, ProAim also makes a four-way and three-way Mitchell leveler and these levelers can allow you to level your Mitchell head without needing to use leg leveling techniques. Speed up your process a little. The rosette angling of the leg is definitely one of the coolest features of this. Is definitely one of the coolest features of this system. Each leg has a rubber foot which you can remove if needed. There is no screw hole or anything underneath. It gives you these measurements for each leg. If you're not going for a fully extended shot, which is more normal, you're going to eye level, you kind of understand your head is going to be a little higher so maybe we'll go to 14 on each leg. Sometimes I'll get, get to a little bit uneven terrain and I'll have a little wobble in the legs. My technique for solving that is finding which part of the wobble is best looks best on your bubble level and then loosening the leg that you have a little bit of space with so when you have that little bit of wobble this leg has a little bit of gap right now I unlock that leg you now don't have any of that wiggle or wobble you're ready to shoot when going from shot to shot, I typically leave the legs at the angles that I've locked them at and just move the entire tripod legs locked. There is that one additional knob that a tripod doesn't have, but the more time I work with these legs, the faster and more easy they are to work with. Thanks for watching.